Got him. That's another nice eater. There's another one right there. Oh yeah. That's another nice one. That one. Pretty nice black. Oh yeah. Man. Hey everybody, Jason here with Strike 3 Fishing. Thanks for tuning back into the channel. Today we're back out here on Mark Twain Lake. We got a uh, new area of the lake we're at. No, we're out here trying to find some more crappie on a different part of the lake. And uh, it's all gonna be catch and release today. That's all we're gonna do. And uh, go out and have some fun. We got uh, bluebird skies. It's a little chilly today. I think it's gonna be like 45 to 50 degrees today. Uh, the winds, you know, five to 10 out of the west. Not gonna be too bad today. We're gonna turn the live scope on. Got the all aboard marine. We got the Edgar rods, the Arden reels, sniping brake. We got the thumper drawer fill heads. And we got the Wild Willies OCD uh, plastic. And we might even throw some uh, hair jigs in there or whatever. But, and we also got the uh, Wild Willies uh, waxy sauce. It's, it's the new uh, scent uh, that I used on my uh, last video. So uh, let's go to work and catch some crappie. Thanks for tuning back in. We're going to try to find us some more. Uh, Roman fish and like I said I haven't been up in this area for a long time so I don't know what's up here so we're just going to go look around. Fish here I'm dropping on. Not sure what it is. It's holding still. It might be a crappie like a crappie. Here it comes. That's a crappie. Oh yeah, it's a nice crappie. Decent crappie. Good eater. Good eater out here just by itself roaming. Nine inch fish. He bit it like he was supposed to, come right up there to it, popped it. Today we're using the uh, Wild Willie's OCD wall bash and the Cajun Cricket and that orange and chartreuse color. So. Got the old Thumper Dwarf pill head on there, the Golden Nugget. Breezy up here today. Couple right there. I'm gonna go right to this fish, get its attention. Go to that one sitting still, see if I can get its attention. comes. Got him. Oh, that feels like a better one. 
nice eater fish not a really good one he's just a nine inch eater Man, fell a little better There's one right there, he come up, got it. A nice crappie. Man, they're black. Man, they are just choking it today. Just choking it. Unbelievable. Fun day. A nice chunk crappie here at Mark Twain Lake. There's another one. Yeah. A nice crappie. They're just roaming. That's a beautiful fish. Yeah, just a good eater fish. Out by himself, drop down, he'd come right up to it and smoked it. There you go. Let's see if we can get this on a bite. Cubs. Got him right there. Got him. Woo -hoo. Boy, that was fun. Dropped right there below the boat. Not a very big one, but he bit. Like I said this time of year, they're just out scattering, they're roaming. It's just a matter of finding them, dropping down on them, and getting them to bite. Live scope really helps this time of year. Otherwise, you probably have to get the old spider rig and stuff out. I'm sure you could do a pretty good job catching them that way as well. But this sniping them is kind of fun. Here he comes. Got him. Got that one. A decent fish. Not really, but he feels like it. We're not keeping them anyway today. I mean, that's probably a nine inch fish, close to it, maybe a little less, but they're chunky. Finding them out roaming, then I'm finding them on some cedar trees today. Just a little bit of everything. Here comes a cedar tree. Fished it earlier and caught a couple off of it. We gave it a little rest. Let's see if we can get another one or two off of it. Here comes one. There he goes. He got it. Never felt him. Never felt it at all. Just watched him on a screen come up and suck it in. On the other side of that tree right here and come in there and just work it through there. See if they want it like that. Here comes one. Fought. be all that's gonna come out of that cedar tree. There's a few more fish in it, just not wanting to play. A few more fish in that cedar tree, but they're just not wanting to, wanting to go. I'll give it one more shot. I caught the cedar tree. But I got that nice thumper dwarf pill head on there and I just uh, straightened that hook out a little bit. And I'll bend it right back and we're good to go. Didn't get hung up. You know, I didn't have to 
break off and retie. So that's a good thing about these dwarf pill hitch. The hooks I got, they're a little softer hook. They have no problem getting bigger fish in the boat. Yeah, you can straighten them out and uh, straighten them out when you get in these cedar trees or on the piece of pole timber and you can uh, reuse them, bend them back and uh, saves you time from breaking off and retying. So saves you some money too. We are back in a new area. Here he comes. Oh, he missed it. He didn't even take it. He just swiped at it. Comes again. Go on. Ooh, what is going on with these fish? Fish don't even seem like they want to play. Here he comes. Got him that time. Yeah, that's a nice fish. Finally wanted to play. Man, just made another move. And, uh, nice fish. Back he goes. There's another one right there. That's just a smaller little eight and a half, nine inch fish. A lot of them running around. That's what I'm looking at on the screen right there. I'm just gonna throw down in there and let it sink. There's another one right there. Yeah, that's a better one there. Yeah, that's a good crappie. That's a good one. He swallowed that one. Look at him. Nice one. Swallowed it. Just a, just a solid crappie right there. I knew there'd be a decent fish in there. There's probably a couple more in there too. We'll just get them to bite. Comes one up. Got him. That's another nice eater. Nine and a half inch fish probably. His lucky day. Well, we're having some fun. They're hungry this time of year and they bite pretty good usually when you get around them. These are still kind of grouped up a little bit. But... There's another one right there. Oh, yeah. That's another nice one. That one. Nice black. Oh yeah. Man. There he is right there. Beautiful. Spot lock. Get a quick picture. I'm gonna throw him back. Alright, well we got a picture, we're gonna throw him back. There's another one. Just a nice solid eater. Just keeping them. Nine inch fish. Eh, he's maybe eight and a half. He's fat though. All right, that's gonna do it for this video. Hope everybody enjoyed it. Uh, 
we'll get back up to the uh, boat up there at the ramp. I'll put the boat on the trailer and then uh, I'll see you guys up there and I'll close the video out. Well, I hope everybody enjoyed this video. We didn't keep any today. It was a catch and release kind of day, but had fun. Uh, chasing them Roman fish. It's that time of year and uh, pretty much the equipment was uh, 10 foot Edgar Rod, 1000 Arden Finesse spinning reel, 15 pound sniping braid, and we caught them all on this uh, where's it at here? We caught them all on that gold nugget uh, thumper dwarf pill head with the uh, Wild Willies OCD Wabash uh, color, orange and chartreuse. Anyway, we're going to start getting out and uh, hopefully uh, for too long they get up on the bank, which probably not going to be for another, I'd say, three weeks or so, just depending on the weather, all that good stuff. So stay with us. I uh, hope everybody enjoyed it, and we'll see everybody on the next one.